kind of my happy place. It's sort of my escape from everything. It's just me and my boat and my paddle and the water, and it's calming. It is a beautiful place, both to get away and sprint towards a goal, a place Nevin Harrison says she's found a second family. It's, it's a wonderful community that Lanier has, and the water is gorgeous. It's perfect for training. Lake Lanier was home base for her Olympic training in a relatively unknown but extremely challenging sport, sprint canoe. It's super unstable because the boats are so skinny. You're going to be falling out a lot and spending a lot of time swimming and getting back in the boat. Canoeing as a competitive sport captivated Nevin when she was about 11 during summer camp. When I saw it, it was like a switch flip and I was like, oh, that is so cool. I've never seen anything like that. I jumped in a boat and it just clicked. I loved it. And up. The sport requires the kind of strength and athleticism that is not only reached by many hours on the water. I was always definitely a strong kid. I remember being 13 or 14 and I benched a plate for the first time. I don't think I ever thought I'd be a pumping iron to the extent that I am. <laughs> Making sure that everything in my body is working properly and really ready to go 100%. Nevin has found her passions early in life, the peace and serenity of nature and an appreciation that it also provides a place where she can push her limits and reach the highest level of competition. I never in a million years dreamed that I would be 19 and going into the Olympics as the current world champion. That was crazy and it's so exciting. I, I get so happy and feel so blessed every time I think about it because it is beyond a dream come true.